Got a news alert on UPS. The company is buying electric vehicle takeoff and landing aircraft to be tested for use in its network. Frank Holland is here with a story you will see first on CNBC. And what are these machines? What are we talking about with these vehicles, Frank? Hey, good morning, Becky. Uh, well, first, UPS does plan to combine e-commerce with these eVitals for its express division. So CNBC is getting a first look at how UPS will buy the 10 for it's buying from Beta Technologies. For those who are unfamiliar, eVitals, they take off like a helicopter, they then fly like a plane. UPS will use them in smaller markets like small planes are used for express B2B deliveries. And eVitals, they could enable delivery to the top of manufacturing sites, hospitals, and other locations for a premium. Create flexibilities where these aircraft can be flying constantly, where you don't have to be tied to specific airports, where you can go building to building. And eventually, this is where it gets even more interesting, where we can take merchandise directly to our customers, whatever they may be. The Evitals have an electric battery, five propellers, and a 50-foot wingspan. They also carry about 1,400 pounds. That's just about half the max of a small plane. Fully charged, these Evitals can travel up to 250 miles at 170 miles per hour. The focus here, obviously on speed, but also on savings and sustainability. The batteries for these Evitals, they're rechargeable and compatible with Arrival EV trucks. Last year, UPS said it would buy 10,000 from Arrival for delivery use. Evitals could also reduce the workers' handling packages and the turnaround time because they can hold shipping containers while small planes cannot. It creates efficiency in the network for us. When you start removing those handles, Frank, and when you don't have to spend time, you know, loading and unloading single packages into these aircraft, you reduce the amount of time that it takes for us to process this, this, this volume. And the EVITALs will be delivered to UPS by 2024 if certified by the FAA. The financial terms are not being released. So, Frank, when I think of these EVITALs, do, are, are they doing the work that normally would be done by the planes at UPS or the, <clears throat> the ones that would be doing the work of the trucks at UPS? What, what are they replacing? They're, they're essentially replacing the trucks, I mean, excuse me, the planes in this trial. Uh, planes right now, they fly to a small airport, they get unloaded, they get loaded into a package truck, then delivered. Sometimes it's a flight from, you know, a location where they pick up packages to an airport, flying to another airport, unloading into a truck, going to the final destination. So right now they're replacing planes, but of course, many more uses are being looked at, tested. And of course, UPS is also looking at drones in the long term. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.